Mr. Cantalizo's first breed is the German Shepherd Dog. This was Germany's most Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. For many years. It was imported into America around the time of the First World War. This so breed I want is you to go up and back and then right around, please. And lends itself to almost anywhere from bomb detection to babysitting. German Shepherd Dog. Belgian Lacanois, strong, agile, and full of life. The Lacanois is one of four native Happy dogs. Happy Thanksgiving. Belgium. Although I know similar it's in body and temperament to the Malinois, Shepherd, and Tavern, the Lacanois differs Thank you. I want to take them down and back, and then go gently right around. Belgian Lacanois. The Belgian Malinois. The Belgian Malinois is another sheep herding dog of this general style. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. It was her birthday yesterday. The Malinois is distinguished from the other three by its short Okay, coat. I want to see her go down calmly and then right around, please. Yep. Belgian Malinois. And the fourth of the Belgian boys is the Belgian Sheepdog. The Belgian Sheepdog is one of your best-known Thank Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. The breed was first Stand. seen in America in 1907, but they distinguished themselves okay, let's in the battlefield during the first and then right around. war, serving as message carriers. This is Belgian Sheepdog. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. Thank you, thank you. In judging this breed, the coat is rated high and important. Okay, I want you to take him calmly up and back and then right around. This is Belgian Traverne. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. Years. During World War I, the Briard has a distinguished career using special backpacks to carry ammunition, medical supplies, and small arms to the front. This is a very tough and intelligent dog, folks. Thank you, sir. I want to see you go down and back and right around. Briard. This is one of France's oldest herding breeds. With World War Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. In his home territory, the Picard nearly became extinct. This dog is people oriented. Nice, let's see him go up and back and right around, please. Pack. Berger Picard.
the Pyrenean Shepherd. The Pyrenean Shepherd has herded sheep in the Pyrenean Mountains of southern France for centuries. Congratulations, he has a very and happy life. He's this position and a superb canine athlete who excels at agility and other dog sports. Let's see him go up and back and slide around, please. Perinian Shepherd. Congratulations and happy Kelly Thanksgiving. Scott, sheepdog herder, is seen here in America in the colonial days. They're intelligent and loyal and very well serious worker. As for the coat, the smooth coat will be small, developed for use in the south. The rough nice. Seem to go up and back and right around. This is Rough Kelly. And this is the smooth version. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving, young lady. I'd like to see you go calmly up and back and then right around. Smooth calm. Shetland Sheepdog. This is a collie in miniature, a native of the Shetland Islands. The habitat in the Shetlands is limited. Congratulations and happy and Thanksgiving. Very hostile. The Sheltie is a companion dog, friendly and very talkative. By the way, he makes an ideal watchdog. <laughs> nice. I'd like to see him go up and back and then right around. Shetland Sheepdog. Australian Shepherd. The Australian Shepherd is not a dog of Australia at all. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. With stock brought to America by sheep herders from Spain. I want to see him go up and back and right around. Building a loyal breed. Australian Shepherd. Miniature American Shepherd, developed in Colorado and Wyoming in the late 1960s. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. The herding dog can be no taller than 18 inches. He is highly intelligent and is said to have a wicked sense of humor, by the way. Nice, let's see him go out and back a bit and right around, please. Miniature American Shepherd.
The Border Collie. The Border Collie is a product of Scotland and England and is the perfect herding dog. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. They made it. sheep is legendary. Easily trained, this is a wonderful companion in the right setting. They're highly motivated to work and are perfect for the farm, but folks, a terrible nice. idea so for go the out and back and ride around for this. Border Collie. Bearded Collie. The Bearded Collie is an old Scottish breed that achieved recognition in the United States in 19. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. This is a Thank serious you, you livestock too. manager, as well as a charming house companion. It also, by the way, is a master escape artist, and he nice. thinks going to take him up and back and then right around. Please. Okay. Bearded Collie. Old English Sheepdog. The word old in this name is not accurate because the breed is probably only less than two. Congratulations years old. and happy Thanksgiving. He was a sheepdog originally, but was later used to handle cattle on the way to market. His coat is resistant to both weather and brambles, as you can see. This guy has gained in popularity unbelievably fast, folks. Okay, want to see force, easy steps, then let her go out and back and then right around, please. Old English Sheepdog. Polish Lowland Sheepdog. The Polish Lowland Sheepdogs are herders of considerable Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. They are squarely built with strong protective coat. This is a fiercely loyal breed that is somewhat suspicious of strangers. Being strong-willed, they do best for the master who is willing to train and socialize them. Nice. Let's see him go up and back and right around. Polish Lowland Sheepdog. The Puli. The Puli is probably an ancient breed coming to Hungary from the East ten centuries ago. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. That, although that's not certain. The Puli is adept at handling herds and flocks. He's also been used as a hunting dog. He is naturally very loyal to his master and family and be quite manipulative. Nice. Let's see you go out and back and then right around. The Pumi is an intelligent herding dog from Hungary as well. They are not a very good dog. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. As they need daily work and lots of exercise. If not, folks, they'd be quite a handful. Thanks. Let's see him go out and back and right around.
Fumi. And folks, this is the booty. It's the third brand new breed that we have tonight, admitted by the American Kennel Club from Hungary. Congratulations, Say hello happy to the booty. Thank you, thank you. He's an extremely versatile, intelligent, all-purpose Hungarian farm dog. He's loyal, protector of property and family without being overly aggressive, a very hard worker. Nice, let's see him go out and back and ride around. Puli, Pumi, and Moody, how about that? The Canaan Dog. This breed is Israel's only native dog and was recognized by the AKC in 1997 when it was 3,000 oh, yeah, years old. A herding dog and camp guard of ancient Hebrews and Bedouins, it became dispersed and lived in the desert as a feral dog. In 1935, the breed was re-domesticated. Canaan Dog. Australian cattle dog. The Australian cattle dog is a drover for Congratulations Australia. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. The cattle industry Same in that country deal. would be at a total loss. He is a silent heel nipper that keeps cattle nice. together. Let's see him go up and back and right around. Than any other herding dog. This is Australian cattle dog. Right around, guy. The Bouvier de Flandre. The Bouvier de Flandre was originally a cattle herder and a powerful Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. Thank you. In France. You too. He is known to many as the Melt Park Dog, which describes one of his historical chores. In Belgium, standards for championship in this breed are high, including tests as police force. Nice, let's see him go up and back and right around. Please. This is Bouvier de Flandre. The Beauceron is an old and distinct French breed developed solely in France with no foreign crosses. Dogs were bred and selected for their aptitude to herd Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. Beaucerons were used to move herds two or three hundred at a time, traveling up to 50 miles a day without showing any signs of exhaustion. This is a Let's tough go up and back and right around. Beauceron. Burger Moscow Sheepdog. This is a sheepdog with a very strong work ethic. Congratulations His coat is and different happy Thanksgiving. Than any other dog. Thank you. It forms long, light flocks, almost like a wool sweater. We wonder if he has to be sent out to be dry cleaned. Okay, let's see him go up and back and then calmly right around. Burger Moscow Sheepdog.
Okay, right around with it. Thank you. Norwegian Bluebar. Bread as an energy. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. They're also trained to aid the hearing impaired, perform some types of police work as well as obedience. They're even in agility trials. Nice. Let's see him go up and back and slightly around. Keep them in motion right around. The Finnish Lapland, this medium sized and strongly built herding dog, originated in the northernmost part of Finland, Norway, and Russia. The Finns have been relying on these tough, intelligent dogs for herding reindeer, pulling sleds, and guarding homes for many, many decades. Nice, nice and easy. Up and back and then right around. Icelandic Sheepdog. Folks, this is Iceland's only native breed. They arrived in Iceland with the first Congratulations Viking settlers. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. His coat happy is Thanksgiving. thick and extremely waterproof. They are cheerful, friendly, and playful. By the way, this breed is not afraid of anything. Nice. Let's see him go up and back and right around. Spanish Water Dog. The Spanish Water Dog originated in Spain many centuries ago. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. He is naturally Thanksgiving. protective and should be well socialized. This is a breed that requires an owner to be at least as smart as he is. <laughs> nice. Let's see you go up and back and then right around. Spanish Water Dog. <laughs> Swedish Valhorn. The Swedish Valhorn is a very old Spitz type breed known since the time of the Vikings. For centuries, the Swedish Valhorn has been kept as a farm dog and used for herding cattle. The appearance of the Swedish Valhorn conveys intelligence, alertness, and energy. By the way, this dog is a distant cousin of the Corgi. Nice. Let's see him go up and back a bit. And then you right might be able to see the characteristics there. Swedish Valhund. Thank you. Cardigan Welsh Corgi. This is a corgi with the tail. Congratulations and, well, and happy corgi Thanksgiving. Means dog. Thank you, sir. Same the to cardigan you. is one of the oldest breeds of the British Isles. Its principal task is to drive cattle. The corgis are friendly companion dogs in any setting. So let's see, go out a bit and right, right, right around. Obedience, herding, tracking, and agility. This yeah. is Cardigan Welsh Corgi. Come on, girlfriend. Come on.
keep her in motion, please. And here's the dog of the late Queen Elizabeth, the Pembroke Ralph Corgi. This is the Corgi without the tail. Congratulations and happy Thanksgiving. Tastes good, young lady. Century England. The Pembroke is shorter than the cardigan in body length. Its legs are sh is straighter, and its coat is finer. The cardigan's ears are rounded, and as you can see, the Pembrokes are pointed. Nice. Let's and see you go up and back and right around, please. Pembroke Welsh Corgi. We're going to make a short list, starting with the German Shepherd dog out here. The Belgian Sheepdog. The Berger Picard. That's Smooth Collie. The Miniature American. The Old English. The Pumi, the Moody. Cattle Dog. And the Bird. Boo. And the Lap Hunt. Puts back the rest. I want you to stay in front of these markers at all times. Walk out five feet, let me see your free stack. And when I say thank you, go right around. Thank you, right around with your shepherd dog. The Belgian sheep dog. Thank you, young lady. Thank you. Take him around, please. Very nice. Right around with her, please. Thank you. Take him right around, please. Thank you, sir. Take her right around, please. Take him right around, madam. Very nice. Right around with him, please. Thank you, sir. Take him right around, please. Thank you, madam. Right around, please. Move up a little. Thank you. Right around with the lap, hon. <laughs> Very
First is the German Shepherd dog. German Shepherd, coach. Old English is second. The Pumi is third. The Finnish Lap Hound is fourth. Thank you, folks.